If there's one thing that's hard for a shopper to resist, online or off, it's a bargain. Who wouldn't want to buy something for 20, 30, or 50% off? But therein lies the problem. 50% off of what? <laughs> Retailers often use things like list price or manufacturer suggested retail. But if those things aren't real, then the sale's not real. Simple example, here's a Samsung TV on Amazon. It says the list price is $750, and they're selling it for about $600, saving you 20% or $150. Good deal. Or is it? Here's the same TV on Google Shopping. As you can see, there are plenty of places to buy this TV, shipping included, for about $550. That's $50 less than Amazon. So is $750 really the list price? But wait, it gets better. Let's go to one of the sites selling this TV for $550, B&H Photo. Note that B&H says this TV really cost $947.99, and lucky you are instantly saving $400. Such a deal. As you can see, pricing is often used to create the illusion of a sale. And now, the FTC doesn't allow stores to knowingly do this, but you know it happens every single day, despite the fact that some sites and stores have been sued for it. So what's a consumer to do? First and foremost, don't fall for this. Always assume the list price and the savings are simply made up. Then see if you're really getting the bargain you're promised by doing an online search. That's the only way you'll know. Bottom line, if you're the type of shopper that loves a bargain, and who isn't, just make sure you're getting one because the internet makes shopping easy, but it also makes verifying deals easy. Use it. And if you want to find more bargains every day, I can help you out with that. Go to moneytalksnews.com. Just do a search for shopping. For Money Talks News, I'm Stacy Johnson.